Okay, so I came back. Um, I wanted to show you the finished bracelet. I thought it came out pretty nice. I mean, you can play with these beads if you want to. You can change the color up that e excuse me, that easily. I must be getting hungry. See that? That's pretty cool. I like that. I like that about this bracelet. So anyway, I thought it came out nice with the, uh, I know my hands are horrible. Sorry. Yeah, you could see the, I used a uh, fishing line. I think it was six pounds. I think it was a six pound or eight pound. The only thing I had a hard time with was the, um, wire guards. I had to take the needle off. Well, the whole bracelet gave me a hard time, but that was not the bracelet's fault. <laughs> it was just the day's fault. So, um, anyway, I had to take the needle off to get the thread through the wire guard because it, I was using a, a big eye needle and it just doesn't work in the wire guard guards. So, I don't know. What do you think? Kind of like it. So, I have small small wrists and I can't get it quite right. Like I probably I don't know. Might have gotten away with two less. I'm not sure. But anyway, there's this one and then I made this one. This is all from the curated bead box. This is with the memory wire, and um, I put some chain on, so if it snags, I won't lose it. The only thing, things that weren't from the box, the curated bead box, were the cubes, the bicone, bicones, the seed beads, and the thread. Everything else was from the curated bead box. So I got two bracelet and earring sets. Another two bracelets, plus all of this stuff left to do something with. I think that's pretty good for $20. I mean, there's a lot of stuff left over. I could make more. I'm probably going to do something with the pearls and these guys because I like the color combination. Um, so yeah, four bracelets, two pairs of earrings, plus. So I'm making good use out of the box. I will be making more, and I will bring it to you. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye for now.